This is Tyler with Truffle Shuffle, and I'm going to show you how to make the Relenti Radiatory Pasta Kit with truffle sauce. So we want to bring a large pot of water to the boil. It's very important. Here I have a uh, three-quart pot, but basically you just want to make sure you have a large pot of water so there's enough water for that pasta to cook in and have enough space in between it. So I'm going to go ahead now and salt the water for my pasta. As you can see, the salt increases the heat of the water. So now I'm going to go ahead and add all of my lovely radiatory pasta from Relenti. So when you add all the pasta to the water, you want to just give it a quick stir. And we're going to bring it back to the boil. And basically, we want to stir the water to make sure that the pasta doesn't stick to itself. And again, as you can see in here, there's plenty of water so that pasta can flow around freely. So we're going to cook this for about eight to nine minutes or until al dente. So we're using this lovely organic radiatory pasta from Relenti up in Oregon. So they use organic durum flour and organic whole grain flour to make the pasta, which basically they mix with a little water, extrude, and then dry at really low temperatures to keep all that flavor and integrity. You see that? They look like little radiators, hence the name. So we're gonna cook it just to al dente. And now we're gonna drain the pasta. So we're gonna reserve about a half cup of the pasta cooking liquid and add it to our drained pasta. And this sauce and that water is gonna to cook together to make our pasta sauce. And the radiatoria is perfect for this because you, as you can see, the ridges in the pasta just catch all that tartufata. That's why we chose the radiatoria. So now we're going to plate our pasta. It's cooked down with that beautiful tartufata sauce. We really like to finish it with a little grated Parmesan cheese. And just a drizzle of olive oil. This is our Relenti Radiatore with truffle sauce.